we often get questions on how we can produce so much content. Uh, I mean, we post on the blog each week. Yeah. And don't you have any day jobs to go to? Yes, of course we do. Uh, and the thing is, we don't focus on unnecessary details when we produce content, so we cap it at the uh, average level to get production yeah. done. And just to quote one of the founders of Revolution Race, who says, I'll settle with done because perfect never gets done. And you and I sometimes talk about gear more, good enough, move on. And we do this a lot when recording. We usually don't do like 10 different takes of each movie. We do like one or maybe two maximum. We don't have a green screen. We don't have a big crew where we need to sync our calendars. If in the beginning we did it from our bedrooms, now we have upgraded a bit, but we try to keep it in a way that it actually is quite easy to do. So we have not really created a, a too big machine for this. We set it for like 80-90% as like that is good enough, move on. Uh, but what is GMO is of course a little bit depending about you, what you do. If you are like doing a finance process for VAT in the US, then maybe GMO is something else. But I think it's a good way of figuring out your level. Yeah, it's, it's like finding the MVP of producing contents to what is good enough to actually have a high production rate to, to get things published this week. Yeah. And, and for us it's been uh, not to overcomplicate things. So yeah, I mean, if, if one recording for one episode would have taken four hours, we would never have done it. So what does GMO stand for no. now again? And, and exactly, if, if you put in four hours, you would get uh, it's a diminishing return of investment. So, yes. so, so uh, it, it's mainly just to find the shortest. And, and the acronym GMO is of course good. Enough. Move on. Hey, <laughs> thank you for watching and have a nice Thursday.